module of the course. In this module, we'll show how to connect the 7447 IC to the seven segment display and how to generate the numbers 0 to 9 uh, using the 7447 IC purely uh, by uh, giving inputs through hardware. So as you can see, as you'll see in this module, uh, we'll show how giving the four binary inputs from say 0000, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1 and so on, uh, using these inputs, how you can actually uh, see the output, corresponding decimal output, on a seven segment display. Now we move on to interfacing the 7447 decoder IC with this seven segment display. We connect the 744 IC, 7 IC, to the breadboard over the bridge in this manner. As you can see, there is this gap on the top which points out that the first pin of this IC starts on this side. Moving on, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 pins on this IC. As you can see the pin configuration of this IC on the screen, the 8th pin is the ground pin. So, in order to simplify the connections, we have taken out the 5 volt supply pin and the ground pin from the Arduino and connected it to the breadboard. The black wire represents the ground pin and the red wire represents the 5 volt pin. Since these pins are shorted column wise, so we'll take the connections out from these ports. Now we are going to connect the 8th pin of this IC to the ground pin in this manner. The VCC is the 16th pin on this IC. So we'll connect 16th pin of this IC to the VCC port here. Moving on, we have A, B, C and D as the inputs for this IC. A is on 7th pin, B is on the 1st pin, C is on 2nd pin and D is on the 6th pin. Since I have left these wires, one end of these wires open, we will connect it to create numbers on this 7 segment display later after this connection. Now we will connect this 7 segment display with this IC. We will first take the 9th pin which is the 8th pin of this 7 segment display. We need to connect the last pin at the bottom on the left side to the ninth pin of the IC here. Next we need to connect the D pin of this IC which is the pin 10 here on the IC to the second last pin from left 
second pin from the left here. Moving on, we'll connect the C pin, which is the 11th pin on this IC, to the second last pin from left here. Next, we connect the 12th pin, which is the B pin to the first pin on the right in the top side, the first pin in the top right side of this seven segment display. Since we have connected till pin 12 of 7447IC will start with the connections for A, F and G. They will be connected to pin 13, 2, pin A which is the second pin from the right on the top side of 7 segment display. Next, we move on to connection of F of this 7 segment display. So, we will connect the wire to the second pin from left on the top side of 7 segment display and then the corresponding pin here on 7447IC is the 13th pin. So, we'll connect it here like this. Now, we'll connect the G pin, which is the first pin from left on the top side of the 7 segment display, and we'll connect it to the 15th pin of the 7447IC. Then, A is connected to pin 13, F is connected to pin 14, and then G is connected to pin 15. Since we have completed our connection of 7447 and the 7 segment display, we will now switch on our Arduino. Now the Arduino is switched on, we now need to connect the inputs to generate number on the 7 segment display. So, let's say we have to generate 5 on the 7 segment display. For that, as you can see on the screen, the number would be 0, 1, 0, 1 for corresponding D, C, B and A inputs. So, we'll start with A as 1. So, we'll connect A to A is the 7th pin of this IC and we'll connect it to I. Then B is the first pin of this IC and we will connect it to 0 which is the ground. Then we will take C and we will connect it to 1. Then we will take D and we will connect it to ground. As you can see on the 7 segment display, the number 5 is visible. So, this way we can generate any input on the 7 segment display. We have to produce 1 on this 7 segment display. So, for that we need to keep the inputs D, C, B and A as 0, 0, 0 and 1. So, what we need to do is we will connect D, C, B inputs to the zero supply like here and then we will connect the A pin which is the seventh pin of this IC to the VCC supply and we will switch on the Arduino. As you can see here, one is visible on the seven segment display. So, this way we can generate any number on this seven segment display.
so we are done with the interfacing of 7447 IC with the 7 segment display.